I'm a little butterfly, so this is gonna be reviews on the road, my first video for this, and also my first video in a year coming back. Uh, so this review is about Skipping Rocks by Susan Schultz. <laughs> I also did a review for her a couple years ago um, for Tales from the Graveyard. It's, it's on my channel. It's a good review. I just I just look real rough on that video. So um, this is a collection of poems, and it's a collection of poems that is centered around um, the author's life, and it's just really enjoyable. I gave it four stars because I really liked it. I really enjoy it, and I think a lot of y'all would like it too. Um, I resonated with a lot of the poems emotionally connected with a lot of the poems and found a lot of similarities emotional wise even though i might not have gone through the same events that inspired the poems for her emotionally i can connect with those feelings that was put out in those poems so i have a couple of favorites in here my very favorite like my number one was March I really really like that poem because I made I think it felt like after reading it it feels like what you feel when you come out of like a depression fog like after you've been depressed for so long and then you finally come out of that depression that's kind of what you feel then also for favorites we have the moon child we have skipping rocks uh we have i drunk out jesus just the second i read that title it made me laugh like that put a smile on my face before i even read the poem i just like okay <laughs> like i didn't know what to expect of the poem um skipping rocks of course was also a good poem um for mom was a really good poem that had me um ugh, that poem had me like in my feelings a little bit like i i really enjoyed that poem um everything that i save gets thrown away i really like that one and i think i said fireflies already but i really really enjoyed fireflies too i think that's probably my, like my number two does march and as my favorite and then fireflies is my second favorite um because fireflies to me it really i don't know if she intended it to be that way but just that childhood freedom that you have when it gets away from you, you no longer have it anymore but you don't realize that until you hit adulthood and you like fuck i miss being a kid so i really 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 enjoyed that um so all in all it was a really good book it was quick but it was it was really good i really enjoyed it i would recommend it the only thing that i didn't like um which i am not gonna say i didn't like the only thing is just i wish it was included was kind of like a timeline so we kind of got the idea of like what part of her life that certain poems were happening and what parts of her life inspired that certain poem i guess i should say um just was this something from her childhood this was from her adulthood just something some kind of timeline because then it felt like i didn't know like how to i guess look at the poem like not knowing what part of her life she was in when that feeling came over her so i wish there was some kind of timeline to follow just to know when certain things happened um but other than that that's the only reason why i gave it four stars everything else was amazing and i love poetry so i'm a lot harder um when i'm talking about poems um just because i love poetry so i'm a lot harder i guess on my review of poems versus other books so that is all you guys this is something i want to start doing reviews on the road trying to make myself do quicker reviews other than doing like 10 minute long reviews which i'm pretty sure i'm still gonna have those but just you know when i guess when i'm out and about um i just got off i'm just waiting for my daughter to get off the bus so i was like well let me just sit and record it so happy to be back on booktube this is not gonna be a one and done a lot of things has changed since the last time that i made a video so i'll do a video about that um i have a lot of life updates so yeah so thank you guys for watching my video stitch is still my spirit animal and i will see you guys next time bye